Hey, 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 Virgo. This is going to be an energy reading for Virgo. If you are a Virgo, this energy reading is going to be for you, beloved. Okay? Um, prior to starting, you guys, this reading, I heard you're right. Okay? Someone is saying that you were right. I don't know if you foreseen something or um, you got an inkling about something, but somebody's definitely like, you were right. And they're shocked about it. Like, they're like, you were right. I don't know. That's what I just keep hearing. Okay, you are rare. I'm going to give you an offer soon. This is someone who looks at you as a rare being. Okay, you're out of this world, Virgo. Okay, something that you foreseen, it came to life. It came true, okay? And this person is stunned by it, like shocked at the fact that you were right. Okay, so that's significant, but let's see. The Virgo spirit, what does Virgo need to know? What does... Virgo needs to know. I feel like you're helping this person to awaken to something. Okay, but I'm gonna get ready to tap in. I ask my higher self, the most high and the ascended masters to help me this intuitive reading. Hi, baby. Alrighty, on the bottom of the deck for Virgo, you guys have pieces of choice. Okay, Leo energy behind there. So you guys could be dealing with a Leo. Okay, let's see. We have, how I feel about you, it scares me. Okay, this is someone who says how they feel about you, it scares them, okay? Pisces energy can be significant. Okay, let's see. For Virgo spirit, what does Virgo need to know? I'm going to give you an offer soon. This is someone who plans on giving you an offer soon. Okay, maybe you were right about a Pisces, something about you being right about a Pisces, Virgo. Okay, let's see. For Virgo, you guys have, I want an open relationship. Whoever this is, fire energy. Aries Leo says, this is someone who wants an open relationship. Okay, or they may be finding out this Pisces wants an open relationship. Flip switch the rose hat goes for you. Okay, let's see. For Virgo, my heart is broken too. Whoever this is, they're saying that their heart is broken too. Okay. This is someone who's finding something out about a third party. That's really what I'm getting, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we have, I wish things were different. This person wishes things were different. Fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sag, okay? I keep my distance to avoid my true feelings and I am desires for you. So this is one, someone who keeps their distance, okay? They're trying to avoid their feelings. It's something about their feelings for you, okay? And their desire for you. This, this is someone who's very passionate, about you okay my soul is crying out for you this is someone who's saying their soul is crying out for you okay their soul recognizes your soul namaste okay i still read our texts and think about you a lot this is someone who thinks about you a lot okay they could be in a karmic relationship okay scorpio energy could be significant this is someone who's saying that you're the best that they ever had virgo okay and taurus energy can be significant okay oh we Let's see. Maybe you told them they were dealing with a karmic. And they're realizing that now. Okay? But they're wishing things were different. Okay? When it comes to you guys' connection, maybe they were already dealing with this karmic when they met you, Virgo. Okay? Let's see. Trust your intuition. Because I'm seeing the high priestess here in the death card. Scorpio energy. I'm definitely seeing some type of change coming about. Okay? You made some type of judgment call. You followed your wisdom when it came to um some type of cycle some type of change you were making okay i'm seeing you going through a transformation okay you could be a high priestess or um very just very intuitive some of you guys could be readers okay but there's definitely something that you foreseen or um you picked up on intuitively that now this person is starting to understand okay five of wands leo energy this could have been someone who was going through some conflicts arguing fighting definitely hearing arguing and fighting Okay, they could have put you in competition with someone. Okay, I'm also hearing friend. I don't know if you're friends with this person or you were friends with the karmic. I don't know, but let's see. For Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? Aries energy is also significant. Okay, let's see. At the bottom of the deck, you guys have the Six of Cups, Scorpio energy. Someone's very nostalgic about you. Okay, this is a past life soulmate who was stalling the situation. Leo energy. Okay, something has been illuminated to this person. I'm trying to tell you. Something has been illuminated to this person about someone of their past. Okay, so let's see. For Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? We have the temperance card, Sagittarius energy. 
Okay, you could be an alchemist. All right, very temperate. Okay, tranquil is what I'm hearing. Okay, but someone's coming to some type of realization. Okay, let's see. For Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? We have the Ace of Pentacles. Whatever this realization is, it's, it's an opportunity for someone to prosper, to grow. Okay. You triggered some type of growth or change in someone. Okay. Let's see. This could be someone who's awakening to their divinity. For Virgo, what does Virgo needs to know? What does Virgo needs to know, spirit? I'm definitely seeing you being very gifted. You could be looked at as like an earth angel. Okay. With the star card here, though, Aquarius energy, I feel like someone is unfulfilled, disappointed. They're in despair about something that has happened. Okay. We have the justice card here, Libra energy. This could have something to do with a court case, court situation, okay, or just the truth being exposed. Someone's receiving clarity, okay, which is helping to balance some things out. This is someone who wants to take accountability, okay, for a situation. Virgo, for Virgo spirit. We have the two of swords here. It came out in a challenging position. This is someone who's still indecisive, though. They're stalling the situation. Okay, this is someone who's also suffering in silence about a situation, but peace is a choice. Okay, you could be restoring your peace, but I feel like this is someone who made a bad choice. This could have to do with someone being disloyal, dishonest, heavy Libra energy. Okay, for Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? Someone wasn't seeing something clearly, but I feel like your truth is helping them to see something more clearly. Okay. You guys have the Six of Swords, Aquarius energy. Whatever it is that you spoke about is helping this person to move on, move into common waters. Okay, this is some, this could be someone you're moving on from. Okay, headed towards new opportunities. So let's see. For Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? We have the Six of Pentacles here. You're coming into even reciprocity. Okay, you're being gifted something. Someone wants to give something to you. Okay, but you have you could have this person blocked with the seven of wands here, or you could be protecting your energy from this person. Leo energy. Okay, this person is seeing that someone was trying to create some type of challenges for them or wanted them to struggle. Okay, that's why they're unfulfilled, unhappy. They could have been dealing with someone very defensive, someone who wanted this person to block you. Okay, we have the sun card, Leo energy. But there was definitely something illuminated to this person, the truth. The truth about somebody is coming out, okay? Yeah, with the moon card at the bottom of the deck, cancer energy, whatever was done in the dark, it got exposed. And I feel like you were the one to illuminate this to this person, okay? And they're wanting to communicate to you about some secrets or something that was hidden from them that is now has been illuminated to them, okay? Someone was definitely deceiving this person, possibly with communication, they could have been dealing with dealing with somebody who was very untrustworthy. Okay, wanted this person to be oppressed. This could have been someone who was jealous of you or wanted to create some type of delays, a queen of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, king of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This could be a baby's father, father figure for some. Okay, let's see for Virgo. What does Virgo need to know? You definitely illuminated something to somebody. Okay, something that they weren't seeing clearly. Okay, but it's whatever you did illuminate, I feel like it's helping this person to move forward. Okay, they may end up blocking someone. Let's see. We have the four of wands here. You could have illuminated something when it came to a marriage, a twin flame union, or when it comes to someone you lived with. Okay, because the four of wands could be home, stability. Okay, but I'm definitely seeing you meet milestones as well. Okay, let's see. You could be coming into a new home. Okay, that could be a new opportunity coming in for you, Virgo. So let's see, for Virgo, what does Virgo need to know, Spirit? What does Virgo need to know? We have the world card. Definitely seeing you close out some type of cycle with a twin flame. Okay, you could be moving on to new opportunities. Okay, but I'm also seeing you accomplish something. For some, you guys could be graduating soon. Okay, but I'm definitely seeing success. 
okay getting recognition for the, those successes mastering something okay let's see for virgo what does virgo need to know spirit we have the three of cups you're definitely going to be celebrating something okay but i'm also seeing a cycle close out with a friend or someone you were connected to something about a friend is significant okay maybe you need more support from friends or you're going to friends for support okay these could be the individuals who celebrating you okay but i'm also seeing someone wanting to reconcile with you this is that person who's been nostalgic about you scorpio cancer energy taurus virgo Taurus, Virgo. Some of y'all could be dealing with another Virgo. Okay, but Taurus, Scorpio, Leo, Aquarius energy. Okay, this is someone who betrayed you in secret. Okay, they could have been projecting onto you. Maybe some things of the past. Okay, or things that they were dealing with in the past. Okay, for Virgo spirit, what does Virgo need to know? Maybe you told them that they were projecting. You know, maybe you seen through some things and you kind of told them some things that they needed to heal from, especially with that star card in reverse is about healing too. Maybe you told them it was some things that they need to heal from, maybe from a past situation. Okay, especially if they were projecting onto you. Okay, but this is someone, they could have been given to a friend. This could have been someone who was given to a friend or lived with a friend of yours for Virgo. What does Virgo need to know? We have the Ten of Swords. Yeah, whatever this is, it's a betrayal. Okay. There also could have been a friend who wanted to see you fail. Okay, this could have been someone who was speaking ruthlessly on your name. Okay. Or there was a friend that was feeding into it. Okay. We have the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Okay, this could be you. You can have fire in your chart. But I, especially with the Nine of Pentacles after that, Virgo energy, you definitely can have fire in your chart. But this is someone who finds you to be very attractive, warm, passionate, enthusiastic, okay? Steadfast, okay? Independent, successful, accomplished, okay? Especially with that Six of Wands behind there. This is someone who looks at you as victorious, okay? They want to have a romantic relationship with you or they have romantic feelings for you, but it's something about a betrayal, that could have blocked this person out and it could have something to do with a friend so let's see for virgo what does virgo need to know we have the emperor card hold on you guys all right virgo back to it the emperor card came out in the challenging position i feel like this is a masculine who's about to step into their divinity they're earth angel too very gifted aries energy but this is someone who was trying to control a situation okay this is also someone who's trying to become a better father or a parent. But I feel like they're they they they're kind of immature, whoever this is. Okay, let's see. For Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? You guys have the two of wands here. Definitely seeing a choice when it comes to what direction or path you want to go on. Aries energy. Okay, you're going to need to reflect when it comes to this with Seven of Pentacles. Okay, you reflecting is going to help you to make progress in a situation. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Okay, you could be... Um, you can be invested emotionally in this person. Okay, but I feel like you're going to go through an awakening and start to see more clearly. You're going to see the truth. Okay, when it comes to taking a leap of faith to start a new beginning okay i also feel like you spoke some type of truth which is helping someone to awaken okay it's having them reflect on maybe taking a leap of faith to start a new beginning okay for virgo we have the four of cups here this person could have made you feel rejected okay leo energy with a strength card at the bottom of the deck cancer energy i feel like this person did something out of ego Maybe you told them they were operating out of the ego and they needed to reject the ego, okay? And better listen to their higher self, okay? Heal, okay? Maybe even release poverty, okay? Pisces, Taurus, Leo energy or release or walk away from somebody who was in a poverty mindset. It could have been setting them back financially. Them being in a relationship or a connection with a Pisces, that's definitely significant. 
they be getting ready to close out a cycle and reject the Pisces. They could be realizing that this person is karmic. Okay, it could be a friend of yours. There we go. So let's see. Or a friend of me. Okay, because the three of cups with the ten of swords giving me friend of me. Okay, let's see for Virgo. What does Virgo need to know? What does Virgo need to know? You guys have the King of Cups in reverse. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You also have someone you rejected wanting to reconcile with you. Okay. Someone could have paid a friend to betray you. This is someone who lacks emotional intelligence. They are really shifty with their emotions. Very cold. Okay, I see why you rejected this person. Okay, this is someone who needs to heal too. They got they got blockages. Okay, they're very controlling as well. They try to control the situation by paying a friend to betray you. For Virgo, we have the Empress card here. Came out in challenging position. I also feel like you're about to get ready to step into your divinity. Okay, or learn or, you know, learn your worth. Okay, knowing that you're worthy. Okay. You also could be in the midst of getting ready to birth something new. Or you could be pregnant. Or you just had a baby. Flip, switch, take it how it resonates. Okay. But I feel like these are people that you nurtured, you cared for. Okay. With the moon card, heavy on the cancer energy, Pisces energy. Heavy on the Pisces energy. This is someone who wanted you to feel rejected. They allowed doubts and fears to get in the way. This is someone very deceptive who was projecting negative energy onto you, okay? This is someone who is cruel, okay? Overbearing, bitter, okay? About a connection you have with a baby's father. What? I don't know if this King of Cups is your baby's father. I don't think so. I feel like this is someone who Wanted to control the situation because they were kind of envious of a baby's father. What? They could have paid a Pisces to intervene in a situation with you and your baby's father. Okay. Especially if you left this person, rejected this person, and went towards whoever this Leo, Aries, Taurus, Gemini is. Have you on Leo? Okay. Let's see. For Virgo. Maybe you've seen this. Maybe you knew some. If this was them paying a friend to betray you, then they were just putting energy into talking to friends or, um, or you know, paying mind to the the words being spoke about you. Like they were putting energy into um, speaking ill will, and um, and they've been putting in energy to speak ill will onto you to your friends. Like they were talking bad about you to your friends, and it could have been a situation with a baby's father something about a baby's father is significant but with the four coins at the bottom of the deck capricorn energy this person was doing it out of control they wanted to control a the situation they wanted to control you i feel like you from changing your direction and your focus heavy on the cancer energy y'all could have been dealing with a masculine who's a cancer okay or a pisces scorpio take it how it resonates but i feel like them trying to control a situation really what helped you to change your direction and your focus and end things with someone. Get a change of perspective. Receive enlightenment about surrendering a situation with someone. Okay. Let's see. For Virgo, you guys have the Tower card in reverse. This is definitely someone who wanted to have you continue to feel oppressed. This is someone who tried to oppress you or oppress the masculine. Okay. Have you feeling trapped. This is someone who's set in their own way. They also could be an avoidant. Okay, this is someone who's non-committal. Could be an ex-lover of yours who's in despair because they did something foolish. For some, they may have paid a friend. They had some type of plan to pay a friend to betray you. For some, that is definitely significant. Okay, be mindful because you got a friend of me in your energy, Virgo. Okay, let's see for Virgo. Let's see, you guys have the nine of wands here. Sagittarius energy. You could have set boundaries with this individual. Okay. This is someone who needs to practice more discipline as well. Okay. You can have your guard up to this person. For Virgo. With the four of coins here because they're controlling. Y'all can even have a baby's father that's controlling. Okay. Or have a baby father that was speaking ill will about you to your friends. Okay. Hmm. 
Someone also wants to control your stability. Okay. This is someone who wanted to get some type of material gain by creating blockages for you, having you feeling weighed down with the Ten of Wands, heavy on Sag energy. Okay, this is someone who wanted you to be burdened with a lot of responsibility, stress, create blockages for you, have you lose faith, have you frustrated. This is someone who's receiving karma, heavy on the Sagittarius energy. This is someone who's experiencing some misfortune, some chaos, some bad luck. Okay, they're also suffering in silence, bitter, heartbroken. Okay, about you creating distance between y'all too. Like you learned to create some type of distance or distance yourself from this person because you maybe had realized this person was very bitter. Okay, hurt, Libra, Aries, Sagittarius energy. Okay, let's see for Virgo. You guys have the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. This King of Wands can be the King of Cups. Okay. This is someone who is driven by their looks. Okay. I'm getting a feeling like y'all have, you have more than one fire sign in your energy. It could be a Leo and a Sagittarius. No, a Leo, Aries, and a Sagittarius. They all out here. Y'all can have all three in your energy. Okay, heavy on the Cancer energy too. Someone could be a Leo Cancer cusp. Okay. Someone's mad too. They got they they fist ball. Okay, this is someone who's very lustful. Okay, Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I feel like you're gonna reflect on this and realize this person is a waste of time, especially when it comes to being emotionally invested in this person. You're gonna awaken to the truth. You're gonna start to see more clearly about who this person is, who this individual is. Okay, one of these people in this energy is your divine masculine, but y'all are both are working towards knowing your worth. Okay, when it comes to a situation, I feel like this other person, both of y'all could have gotten betrayed in a situation by friends. Okay, who've been secretly working against you with the moon card, heavy on the cancer and Pisces energy. Okay, let's see. For Virgo, what does Virgo need to know? We have the death card in reverse. It landed on Sagittarius energy. This emperor, this is someone who's resistant to change. Someone's being forced to change in a tower moment. There could have been a tower moment that has already happened. Where you put your guard up and set boundaries with this person because you could have realized this person was trying to control you. Okay. But now they're being forced to change. Leo energy, they're being forced to do their shadow work. Okay. For some, they're being forced to sit down. Okay. Especially when it comes to juggling you. Trust your intuition. Okay. You could also be doing your shadow work, going within, meditating. Okay. About some things that you need to change or that you were resistant to change at one point. Okay, maybe it, I feel like the resistance, the thing you were resistant to change was to end something with somebody that y'all could have been dealing with for a long time. Could have been from four, four, I'm saying four, six, seven years, like a long time. Y'all could have been dealing with somebody and it's like you're resistant to letting this person go. But once you decide to end, officially end things with this person, I feel like that's and you set because you could have set boundaries with this person, but you haven't ended things with this person. And for some, maybe you can't completely end things with this person because you can have a family with this person or kids by this person. But I feel like it has to be an end in between y'all two. Like y'all have to co-parent. Don't be still giving this person sex because of some y'all still giving this person sex. Okay, because you find them to be attractive, but this is someone who's not emotionally invested. They're actually emotionally unavailable to you. Okay. Let's see. For Virgo. Or you could have said that about somebody else and somebody's realizing that about somebody else, about them needing to end something with somebody who was emotionally unavailable to them. Okay. For Virgo, because I definitely see you foreseeing something. Okay, it could be this betrayal because it's a betrayal right in the middle of this read. Okay, Virgo energy. What does Virgo need to know? We have the nine of...